and uh, this is so. your channel, so yep. you might as well be the cop. Mm. Okay. So we are at the Kinzu Bridge State Park. Um, what's left of it? It had, let's see, when's it changed? Uh, 2003, they had an F1 tornado that actually um, used to be trains that went across this bridge. I went across when I was a little kid. Um, we're going to go see this right here, what's left of it. But they were um, restoring the bridge, and what happened was uh, the tornado tore through and totally annihilated quite a bit of it. Quite a bit of the uh, bridge. So now it's just into a walking path, which we're going to go over to right now. And we can walk out onto it and see a very awesome view. So let's check it out. Nice little windy trail going down there. That's cool. It's really windy out here too, so. <laughs> well, hopefully the... And it looks like a bunch of snowmobilers. This is winter time out here, obviously. We actually have snow, finally. Yeah. My other videos, we didn't really have any snow. We were going through a pretty mild winter, so. Yeah, well, the last time I was on one, I mean, we were walking through a car. <laughs> yeah. And there was no snow there at all, really. Yeah. There wasn't any snow, was there? No. Yeah, we went through that tunnel. So. Down the windy trail. Down the windy trail. You cold? No. Oh, it's not like you're shivering. It's what, 22 degrees now. It's beautiful. Yeah. Well, compared to yesterday, it is. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, the weather is an insulate. Yeah. Not bad. Yeah, if you point the camera out there, you can show everybody what's left of the bridge. And uh, not very much. Yeah. It's gonna get really cold and windy out here, just to let you know. So everybody at home watching this, you guys are gonna be freezing just like we are. Not really. <laughs> you guys won't feel any of the effects. Privileges of living up north. I must say, though, a lot of tourist destinations. So. Oh, yeah, a lot of history. A lot of history up north. Well, in the northeast of the U.S., where most people settled when they came over here. out of the European nations. Yeah, there we go. So, yeah, obviously people are turning around right there. Yeah. Snowmobile trails. So they turn the train tracks into snowmobile paths. That's awesome. And at least this is okay. Still like going down those paths too right there. Yeah. There's well, a lot of people have been using them. Yeah. I'm not going to have the winter time. I don't feel like falling on my ass. <laughs> you can see all the paths though. Yeah. See all the trees over here? Look at this. You can hang over. Huh? Yeah, I know that. Yeah, look at all the trees. I mean, you can tell there was a tornado going through there. Yeah. Oh, yeah, easily. All this tree. It didn't even happen on this side, really. You know no. what I'm saying? I mean, there's a few knockover, but that could just be from debris. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm surprised this side, <laughs> this side still secure. Yeah. Like, what's holding it at the end? Uh, hmm? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's just going to, it's going to the next one.
Yeah, you can tell that uh, tornado has definitely been through here. Yeah. So, you know, we get out to somewhat of the center. It's uh, 300 foot down is what it was. And then we'll, of course, have to show you the view. <laughs> Hear that creaking wood? <laughs> yeah, definitely wouldn't make it if we were to fall right here. No. Yeah. Be like a pile of broken bones and guts hanging everywhere, right? Yeah. I'm not even going to attempt to stand on the glass out here. Talk about slippery. Yeah. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> so this is uh, out at the end. Tons of wind. And, yeah, you can walk on that, bro. <laughs> so you guys won't be able to notice too much. And looking down, it's a nice little, uh, you know, nice little drop. Yeah, it mind. doesn't look that deep, but it is. It's a reminder of how high we actually are. And you can see Whoa. just how much Dude, come up to that like that. Just go like this and just <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap. You can see just how much uh well there is quite a bit of the bridge left. It's not exactly yeah, I, would, I would say probably two thirds of the bridge are gone is gone. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> I've already cold as it is, and then you know the the, the view is crazy. Those are trees down there, man. Yeah. Well, somewhat. Yeah. <laughs> it's winter out. That's crazy. Uh, I strongly does advise bringing a train across here. I rode a train across here when I was a kid. Yeah, at this point, though. <laughs> yeah, you ain't gonna make anywhere. <laughs> Actually, you couldn't even do it anyways because there's no track yeah. anymore. Well, maybe so. if you started it over there somehow. Yeah, that's steel beams down there that yeah. carried trains across. That's crazy. You can still see all the concrete pillars that used to be in. Yeah. Yeah, even down there. Yep. Holy crap. Yeah, and you can actually hear the river. It doesn't even look like it's very high when I'm looking down there. Yeah. But you can most certainly tell that it is. Uh, I'm surprised that, like, an injury. Yeah. I'm surprised that, like, uh, an injury. Uh, an adrenaline junkie hasn't jumped off here with a parachute or something. Yeah. You have time. Yeah, you could. Sure, you can put like a, a ramp out here and bungee jump. See? So if uh, anybody with the, uh, you know, Pennsylvania State Commission on um, Parks and Recreation and that, you know, if you guys, you guys can make an awesome platform out here and have something, you know, more tourist, have like a extra platform out here. Or zip line. Oh, a zip yeah. line would be awesome. Just whoosh right out from there. That'd be awesome. So think about that, guys. <laughs> so, yeah, we're, I'm going to walk across this and see if I can fall. <laughs> Holy crap, bro. This is slippery. Ice on it and everything. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> I dare you to run across it. I'm kidding. <laughs> I don't go to the hospital or anything today, but mm -hmm. yeah, that's a river down there. Creek River, what do you want to call it? Oof. Yeah, it's pretty solid on there. <laughs> <laughs> Is it? Holy crap. <laughs> that's my, my hands cold. My hands cold. So, yeah, this is what we do. We like to have uh, fun adventures, go to places, uh, unique places. This is unique. This used to be a bridge, like I said, for trains. This used to be the highest bridge in the world at one time. Highest and longest bridge in the world at one time. Not anymore, you know, only a third of it now, but this is what happens, you know, uh, this is part of history. Things happen. Uh, 
nature sometimes takes course and destroys things but think about it we destroy more than it does so finish up the video showing you guys the walk back it's pretty cool in more ways than one, <laughs> in more ways than one yeah I want to check out another bridge too. It's down in um, the New River Bridge down in uh, was it West Virginia? Let's go over there and walk too. Let's see if they were yeah. just walk over here. I'm not walking down because those people are going to yeah. falling on my ass and crying like a little baby. I got sneakers on too, so Nikes don't work very good for that. Ooh, you hear that? hear that wind yeah, I, don't think, cold. I don't know if they can with the my hand wind. holding this oh so i hope you guys enjoyed that little visit to the kinzu state park kinzu bridge state park um again we're gonna do a lot more traveling and this is just another place i've done the tunnel i've done this place i'm gonna do a lot more in the summer it's cold as hell up here right now in northern western or western new york it's cold i don't want to do any more up here um, but yeah, stay tuned this spring, this summer, we're going to be doing a lot more traveling and we're going to do a lot more exploring in that. So, um, if you guys start liking these videos a little more, I'm going to start traveling a little more because that'll give me more money to work with, to travel to these places. So hit me up guys. Love you guys. Peace. I'm Audi. Chilling with Chuck.